Oi, oi, Mobilisi. Hey everybody, so today I got a doubles battle spot Wi-Fi uh, match against Tick here. Um, so this is the first battle I had with my uh, Lilligant team. Uh, which I was trying to figure out a way to incorporate Lilligant into doubles. This team, clearly not the best way to do it. Uh, as you'll see going throughout the week. Although, I've, I'm not going to make any conclusions about how I feel about Lilligant just yet. Anyway, um, so at this turn, I Mega Evolve with Charizard Y. Uh, I decide there's not much else I can do here. I'm just going to Mega Evolve, Drought, and uh, Heat Wave the hell out of these guys. <clears throat> and uh, he's going to go for the Brave Bird on my Charizard, although I kind of knew I'd live because of the Intimidate and because of my Charizard spread. And I go for the Rock Slide as well, and it's just going to kill his talent point. So that's pretty cool. Uh, and my Charizard's gonna go after the Landorus, and uh, so I'm gonna get the single target damage from Heat Wave onto this Dusclops. However, Dusclops is now going to uh, Trick Room, which is so, so bad for me. Uh, so he's gonna go into Camera Up, and I have nothing to take this. I, I just, I have, I have nothing to be able to take this Camera Up's Heat Wave. Uh, I have to send in Lilligan and just sack it. It's dead now. <laughs> um, so, as uh, as I switch out and I sacrifice Lilligant, um, I protect with Charizard because I just don't want Charizard to die just yet. I, I, I like I think I can maybe win the battle between Charizard and. Uh, everyone else. And he actually doesn't heat wave. He goes for the eruption, which is like, oh my god, that's even worse. It does more damage than heat wave. And he's gonna be faster than everybody. So I have to find a way to get damage on this stupid thing. So I go to my Machamp. Machamp is the only way I can get damage on this thing. Uh, he luckily goes for the flamethrower, which does still kill me, partially because of the job, partially because of his high special attack and sheer force. But thank god. And the Dusclop just goes for ice punch for like some random reason. Maybe freeze hacks? I don't know. So I go for Dynamic Punch and do a buttload of damage to this camera up, and now I'm like, okay, if I win the Confusion Hacks, I can actually maybe win this battle, which would be, I would love that, okay? Um, so I Intimidate them again, uh, which it, it doesn't really matter that much. Uh, the Dust Clops is using physical attacks, uh, but it doesn't matter that much. And now here what I should have done uh, is I should not have hit the camera up. I should have killed the stupid Dust Clops right now. I should knock off the Dusclops' Dome Eviolite and kill them, and I should have Earthquake. The, but the, the thing is, the reason I didn't want to Earthquake here was because um, I didn't want Machamp to take any unnecessary damage, because these are my only two Pokemon left, and Machamp is all I can use to win the, ba the battle, and I and he has this Ferrothorn, and I'm like, okay, wait, I can win. And here is where the real misplay is. This Ferrothorn Leech Seeds, and I Dynamic Punch the Ferrothorn. I don't know why... If I just knock off this Dusclops, it would die. The Dusclops would have died. My Machamp would not have died. And then I could have killed the Ferrothorn. Uh, however, I get the Iron Barbs and Rocky Helmet damage on my Machamp and the Leech Seed damage. And I don't kill the Dusclops. And the Dusclops got the Ice Punch damage onto me. Which is like really unfortunate because now Dusclops is going to be able to Shadow Sneak me and that's it won't kill my Machamp this turn however his Ferrothorn has Protect uh, so uh, he's, he goes for the Protect here if he hurt himself in Confusion I would have been able to win the match still but he doesn't so uh, my Machamp's actually going to uh, live through this turn it appears because of the Shadow Sneak but the thing is after the uh, Leech Seed damage um, I'm not going to be able to uh, I'm not going to be able to uh, live the next Shadow Sneak. Maybe if my rock... I don't think my Rock Slide would have even killed this Dust Clops. It could have, but I don't think it would have. And uh, even then, uh, the Ferrothorn had been going before my Machamp, so it doesn't even matter. So, down goes Machamp, and uh, Ferrothorn gets missed by the Rock Slide, and I go for the Dust Clops. And it, uh, it does kill it, so... But I got a, I got a crit, so... The crit honestly might have mattered. A non-style rock slide with spread damage? I don't know. So this Ferrothorn's confused. Uh, it uses Leech Seed on me. I'm Choice Scarf locked into rock slide, which is, like, not very effective, like, really badly on this. So basically, the only way I could possibly win is through, um, flinch plus confusion hacks. 
Uh, but he is least seated, and it's just like, uh, I don't know, I'm not going to really deal with it. So he, he hurts himself in confusion, it doesn't really do anything. I rock slide, I like, guess, yeah, it's just not going to do anything. Um, I don't really have any way to kill this thing. Um, so I'm going to run at the end of this match. Again, Lilligant was just not really too useful. Um, I'm going to get in some more battles, I'm going to change the team up. Uh, hopefully, at the start of next week, I'll get some uh, slightly better battles in here. But I didn't want to play out the stall fest, I just ran. There was really no way I was going to win. Maybe if I got like two crits and two flinches in a row or something dumb, I could have won. But anyway, that's the match. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you next time. That's, that's a lot of advancements I do not feel like doing. So we're going to pick a lower thing. I would say... Mine is a fine point, which is something I think, so I'm going to copy that to the clipboard, and we'll see where I click it.